Gladys and welcome to Is That Your Hair? I create hair, fashion, and lifestyle content that will encourage you to be your very best self. So if you're with that, you're in the right place. I'm so excited, y'all. We're gonna hop right into it because it's $20 Tuesday. And a lot of y'all know that $20 Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute wigs that are in the $20 price range and below. So let's just jump right into what I have here. I saw this on Amazon for $19.99. And I saw good reviews. It was a mixed bag, but mostly good reviews. So I was like, I gotta grab this one up. I have two pinky straight wigs, okay? Two of them. I just couldn't believe that they're $19.99 and they're supposed to be like a lace front. Like, where do they do that at? So I'm gonna show you one of the wigs that I have here. I already pulled it out, right, earlier. And look at this. Wow, this feels gorgeous. Y'all, are you, are we for real? $19.99? This is some bomb synthetic hair. Oh my goodness. But you know what? I know why it's so cheap. Look at the lace. This here is your classic hard lace that we had back in the day, like 2015. So if you are not a fan of hard lace, you might want to reconsider, but I suggest you watch this video through and through first because I want to see how this joint looks on me. But already I'm impressed with the fibers. It does come with, it looks like one comb in the front. That's it. One comb in the front, a comb in the back, has the adjustable straps, has this ventilated cap here. Yeah, this is the parting space. We don't have a lot of parting space going on. This looks about like maybe two and a half inches with a little curve here. But I can, I can work with this. I can work with this. So let's try this beauty on and see how I feel about her in real time when she's on. Also, if you're curious about the wig that I'm wearing on my head, this was from $20 Tuesday like two months ago. One of my favorite headband wigs this year, hands down. I love this starter lock look. These are like little twisties. And a lot of y'all seem to like this one and bought this one since I put out that video. I will leave a link down below in case you still want her. But I've worn this a ton of times just inside and outside of the house. And I also noticed that the more you wear this joint, the more lived in it looks, the more real it looks. And that's what I really appreciate about this headband wig. I just love my natural textures, y'all. You just can't go wrong. So if you're interested, check my description box. But right now, we're gonna take this bad boy off, okay? And we're gonna put on this kinky straight unit. Are any y'all on the website already? Because if this joint looks good on me, I feel like it might sell out. So I'm tossing this on my head. Okay. She is on. I got her a number two, right? This looks a little dark for a number two. Let me just get her together here. Oh, wow. <laughs> I haven't had hard lace in a while. If you do decide to get this wig, I suggest that you make sure your edges are moisturized because the hard lace will do a number on your edges, okay? I, I think I wanna wear this to the side. Okay, y'all, so. This is what the wig is looking like without me doing anything to her. This is what she's looking like. $19, y'all, and 99 cents. What do you guys think so far? Do you think that she's gonna be a win? Oh my God, the shedding. Maybe I cut too much into the lace. I feel like it wasn't shedding like this when I first took it out the back. Be mindful of that when you um cut the lace. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna fall in love with this one. Hard lace and all. Let's let the music come in. I'm gonna hook this one up and I'll be back with my thoughts. Now behind the story goes Brown sugar got me open Now I want some more Always down for all my nonsense swine But I think I'm here to solo Who my niggas don't want Stick out my tongue and I'm about ready to hit this Pretty, pretty bitty with persistence Yo, I don't think y'all hear Brown sugar, babe I guess high off of love Don't know how to behave Brown sugar, cause you're my love Oh, 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 oh,
right y'all so i am back with this unit <laughs> yo oh man so y'all tuesday is on and popping y'all may as well just go on to the website and add this one to the cart too this is a look the texture alone is absolutely gorgeous now mind you i was getting a quite a bit of shedding but i feel like it's diminished now and i do think it was because i cut really close to the lace main pros to me is the texture and i like the length and i love that the ends are feathered it's not like a blunt cut you know what i mean you see that and you guys did see me go on for my scissors to try to add some light layers i didn't do too much i'd probably continue off camera but i just wanted to show you that's how i would do it when adding the light layers i love this unit to the side i think it looks super pretty yes y'all i'm here for this especially with this little dark lippy comment down below let me know how you feel about this unit y'all because for 19.99 i don't think it can be beat now i would say the biggest cons would have to be the hard lace but for me it's not a super big con because i don't mind it that much one thing i like about hard lace is that it lays really flat i didn't even use any got to be glue y'all i just put my pressed powder and that was it but like i said moisturize those edges y'all if you're gonna get this unit as far as the cap size i definitely think this is for medium size heads and below because it's fitting me just right so if you have a size 23 head just know that you know your edges will probably be sticking out a little bit you might have to tug it a little bit in order to get it on but for the price i think it's worth giving it a try especially with amazon's return policy if it doesn't fit you can definitely send it back very easily to me this is a win i don't even know how i came across this unit i was just you know on amazon like i normally am every other day and i was looking for hair and i found this and i was like hold on is this i thought it was like a headband wig at first because i saw the price but no there's lace on this joint and i like that they made this a curved part i'm here for that oh my god i just keep one of my fingers through this because it feels so nice these are not five dollar fibers this does not feel like baby doll hair at oh look at the movement look at the body what <laughs> y'all can't tell me this isn't a bomb 20 dollars slit y'all can't tell me y'all know where the link is at go ahead add it to cart now i did get another color i got it in this very interesting color it's like a mix of like blondes and reds y'all see that uh i'm not really a fan of this color but i will just quickly put it on for y'all so y'all can see what it looks like on me and we gonna wrap this up all right y'all i am back with this unit in this color what do y'all think let me know in the comments it's like a mix of got red a number 27 yeah it's like burgundy and blonde type of mix it's 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 unique it's different a little interesting personally i don't know if this mix is for me and i think it looks good on me but it's just not a mix i would go for but i bought it because i wanted y'all to see it in this color on me in case you know you were curious i will say i like the way that they blended the color like i like the way the root goes into the color here but i just wish it was symmetrical so you see how this number 27 color is face framing here but there's no face framing here you see what i'm saying so a little inconsistency with the color but but that overall y'all this color kinky straight unit is $19.99 i'm honestly not complaining i think it it definitely looks very good on me <laughs> now there's a key difference with this unit that i did off camera it's kinky straight but it's looking a little bit more sleek right because i was trying to get rid of some of the crimps in the hair i use my revlon blow dryer brush and if you know me if you've been rocking with me for a minute y'all know i love this brush this brush has been holding me down for the past two years with my natural hair and my textured units especially my kinky straight blown out straight units every time i want to revive them i use this brush and it's just like Bow! it comes right back to life especially in combination with my simply styling silicone spray what are you kidding me i spread some of this on blow dry it out and it looks as good as new so those are two products that if you don't have them yet y'all y'all may as well go grab them now the revlon blow dry brush and the silicone spray those are two must-haves in my wig arsenal and one thing i love about the blow dry brush is that it doesn't take away the texture from a unit even though it does get hot it really just smooths out the hair look how smooth and sleek this looks 
while still retaining the texture. I love this. I haven't talked about my blow dry brush in a while, but I had to bring it on back in 2021 to let y'all know that it's still bomb and you should go get it. The only con to that brush though is the fact that the heat only comes out from the top part of the brush, but it's not a huge deal to me anymore. I guess I've kind of gotten used to it. So it's still a must have product in my book. But yes, y'all, let me know what you think about these two units. Which color would you grab? Would you get the natural number two color or would you get this like burgundy blonde mix I have here? I think this is a very fall ready color. This is it giving autumn or is it giving winter? What do you think? Let me know. Honestly, y'all, for $19.99, I have nothing else to say. It's a done deal. Just go get the wig. Especially in that natural color. What? Get one for you, your mom, your bestie. I just think it's such a beautiful and super affordable unit to have in your stash. As long as you don't mind the hard lace. But for me, low key, I miss hard lace a little bit. Because hard lace, look at that. It just lays so flat. It just lays so flat. Now, if you are new here, make sure you tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I don't know if y'all noticed, but y'all look around. We are on the road to 30,000 subscribers. <laughs> I am so excited about that. I'm so freaking stoked. I cannot believe it. Can y'all believe that? And it's been what, like over two and a half years we've been doing this thing? We gotta keep this train in motion. Thank y'all so much for rock with me and for just being such a supportive community. Y'all are just A1. Especially for those of you that show up to the premiere party. I love y'all. And if you wanna see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.